Hello everyone. Today we are going to be doing a science experiment. We're going to be making our very own plasma cutter. What you're going to need for this experiment is four 9 volt batteries, a raised sheet like a cookie sheet or a brownie pan, a graphite lead like that from a mechanical pencil, and two alligator wires. What you want to do first is connect the 9 volt batteries in a series positive to negative. If they are new batteries, you may have to push kind of hard to get them into the slots. Positive to negative, and once again, positive to negative. So once you've done that, you'll want to set that down, and you'll want to take your first alligator wire, and stretch it out, and connect it to the positive side, or negative side, each side of the circuit works, and you want to connect it there. And then you want to take the other head of your, of your alligator clip and attach it to your graphite blade. Then you'll want to take your second alligator clip and attach it to the other side of the battery series. And then, then you'll want to attach it to here. And make sure it doesn't snap off. Obviously, I didn't have that on tight enough. There we go. Seems to be working now. Now, once you've had that, you're ready to start cutting. But before I demonstrate, I'd like to tell you the science behind this. For any substance to be able to conduct electricity, first it must contain electrons or ions that are freely moving charged particles. With graphite and metal, electrical conduction is made possible by electrons, which have been delocalized, which basically means they're not firmly bound to any specific atom. Both diamond and graphite are made entirely out of carbon, same as recently discovered Buckminster Freud, which is a soccer ball shaped molecule containing carbon-60. Diamond can't conduct electricity, however, because it is a solid hard structure, while graphite is a layered form of carbon. The layers of free-flowing atoms allow it to conduct electricity. Since electricity can be conducted through the graphite, when the graphite makes contact with the aluminum foil, the heat from the electricity slices right through it. Now that I've told you the science behind this, let's get cutting. There you have it folks, this has been the Plasma Cutter Science Experiment.